Now, with well, the tow truck driver suing Hampton after being there for the city day and night for years. And he said that he was suddenly taken off the on call list for crash cleanup. And he says that's what sent him into financial ruin. Tenor News Science Jason Marks has more for us tonight. $800,000. That's how much a tow truck company's asking for from the city. They say the city destroyed its business. You have to stand up for what's right. Helping people is what Wesley Ash has done for the last decade. You take pride in what you do. Ash, a Hampton native, founded 316 Towing. In 2015, his company was added to the Hampton Police Division's on call list for towing, a rotational list that's used every time there's a crash. Last year, Ash, with help from police and approval from the city attorney, began a cleanup program to sweep up debris and sop up spills. You have car wrecks and they leave nasty messes behind. In January, the company was suddenly removed from the on-call list. Ash was told he was overcharging, a claim he says just isn't true. From the ground up, had approval with everything. Ash was forced to leave Hampton. He's had to sell several trucks. Others were repossessed. He's headed towards bankruptcy. It sucks. <laughs> I'm, I'm a tough guy and I'm a proud person. But it sucks. It really sucks. Uh, I, I can't come up with a better word than that, guys. With his company hanging on by a thread, Ash decided to take the city to court. And when you had a clear path and you never saw it coming, it just, it's really devastating. Ash says he didn't want to go down this path. He just felt there was no choice. We could have talked about things and done things a different way, but there was no talking about anything. We reached out to the city and we were told no one would comment because it's pending litigation. That's the latest here in Virginia Beach. Jason Marks, 10 on your side.